Hello, hello. How are you today? Hi, teacher. Hi, hello, my dear. How are you? Fine, thank you. And you? Fine. Thank okay, you. Hey, very good. It's nice to have you here in class. So today is Wednesday. So we just have tomorrow, and then you are going to be free to complete the platform. Okay? Okay. So, um, it's only three, three of you. Yes. Okay. We are going to wait for the other people to come. Uh, meanwhile, I just want to comment that I see a message from Ingles Corporativo where they are asking that you can advance completing the platform. I also have seen some uh, messages from uh, some people saying that they will do it during the weekend. So I just want to encourage you to please do it during the weekend in order that we can advance. Okay. Uh, thank you, Julie, for helping, um, uh, uh, let's see, for helping our classmate, I think was uh, Nelson. Yes. Okay, so thank you for being uh, supportive each other and to help to solve the platform uh, exercise. Uh, it was okay. with Noe. Okay, very good. So, uh, I'm going to share the platform. <clears throat> Let's see. We are now in 3.7 lesson. Uh, but before we advance, I just want to uh, make sure that you go to the platform and that you listen to the conversation. Uh, that it's uh, where the lady is talking about what there is or there are in a new apartment. Okay, so I want that you can continue. There is and there are with, with this conversation. Okay, for today, we are going to focus on uh, lesson objective 3.7. And it says, in this session, we will take a look at quantifiers to ask questions and give out answers, okay? <clears throat> so here you have a, a video that provides an explanation about quantifiers. For example, quantifiers are, uh, it says count, count nouns, quantifiers a lot, a few, many, any, no one. None qu count uh, quantifiers a lot, much, any, no one, little. And then you have a video uh, for you to play and to listen as much as you can or that you would like to listen in order to have it clear. And that's basically what we are going to do because later it comes the knowledge check session. So by now we are going to have uh, extra material in order to practice quantifiers. Okay, so I'm going to stop sharing the platform and I'm going to share the presentation that I have for you tonight. Okay. <clears throat> Let's see, okay, good. Here I have a presentation that says quantifiers in English, and we have quantifiers that we use with uncountable nouns, some other quantifiers that we use with countable nouns, and some others that can be used with countable and uncountable. For example, for uncountable nouns, I can say, I need much sugar. I want a bit of salt. I need a little water. Uh, I need a great deal of uh, maybe ice cream. I need a large quantity of sun. I need a little, uh, let's see, coffee. I need very little uh, rice or I need a large amount of sugar, for example. Okay, with countable nouns, uh, you say a majority of uh, we can say a majority of students already complete the platform. A great number of people uh, had a holiday or Independence Day. Several uh, people uh, prefer to rest on weekends. Um, let's see, many participants connected to the class today. <laughs> And so on. Number of, a number of, a few. So 
let's see. Let's see what happened with it. Okay, I'm going to mute some of you in order that we can listen each other and then um, I will unmute you. Okay, very good. So a large number of, a number of, few, a few, very few. But if I need to practice with uncountable and uncountable nouns, I use all, enough, no one, no, some, more, most, lots of, less, least, any, not any, plenty of. Okay, so now let's see if we can have. Teacher, see excuse you? me. I can't see your uh, screen. <gasps> Sorry. I don't see. Okay. Can you see it now? Ahora sí? Yes. yes. Thank you. Okay. Thank Very good. Nice. Okay. <clears throat> so let's listen. Let's listen and then practice the pronunciation. Okay. Uh, much. Let's pronounce. Much. Much. A, much. a bit of. A bit, a bit of. of. Little. 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 A great deal of. A great, a great deal, deal of, of a large quantity of a large, a large quantity, quantity of, of a little a little a little very little very little, very little. a large amount of a large amount of a majority of a majority of a great number of a great number of several Several. Several. Many. 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 A large Many. number of. A large, a large number, number of. of. A number of. A number of. Few. 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 A, few. a few. A few. Very few. Very few. All. All. Enough. Enough. No one. No. 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 Some. 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 More, more, most, most, lots of, lots of, of less, 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 least, 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 any, any, not any, not, not any, any, plenty of, plenty of. of. Very good. So now that we have uh, seen some quantifiers in English uh, with count, uncountable nouns, countable nouns, and used with both, now I just want to make sure that you remember this one, okay? A, an, some, and any. We use a, an, which is a, a is a consonant sound, an is a vowel sound because it has, um, it has a vowel and a consonant. So for example, we say, there is a bottle on the table. I use a before a consonant, but when I use an, when I use an, it's because the next word starts with a consonant. For example, there is an apple on the table, with a vowel, sorry. There is an apple on the table. So if we have a consonant sound, no problem, we use a. But if we have a vowel sound, we need to add a letter N and say an, okay? Uh, in the case of some, uh, any, we use, um, some or any plus a plural countable nouns or an uncountable nouns. For example, for an affirmative sentence, I say um, an example with some is there is some cheese in the fridge. Okay. For a negative, any, there isn't any cheese in the fridge. And for questions, I say, is there any cheese in the fridge? And here we have a classification. For affirmative sentences, singular uh, countable nouns, we use a, an. For countable plural nouns, we use some. For uncountable, we use also some. In the negative, we can use a, an for countable. Any for plural um, countable nouns. And for uncountable, we use any also. For questions, we use a, an, any for plural countable, and any for uncountable. 
So uh, remember that in the case of questions, we use any for both, for plural countable and for uncountable. Uh, here, uh, there, is a, there are some exceptions. For example, when I have a question, I can offer saying, would you like some uh, fruit? Would you like some uh, milk? Would you like some ice cream? And I use a plural, uh, uh, some for plural countable and some for plural, I mean for uncountable, but only when I'm offering something, okay? Um, for questions, uh, when you ask for something, can I have some uh, ice cream? Or for suggestions, why don't we have uh, some, uh, let's see, some popcorn uh, to watch the movie, okay? Entonces, eh, lo que nos está diciendo es que para hacer preguntas y para hacer oraciones eh, negativas utilizamos para plural countable any y para un countable también any y que las únicas excepciones es en preguntas cuando estamos ofreciendo algo y que utilizamos would you like to verdad or can I have some or when I give a suggestion why don't we have some okay only in those cases you use some okay Okay. okay, let's repeat the sentences, please. Uh, there is a bottle on the table. There is a bottle on the table. There is an apple on the table. There is an there apple, is an on, apple the on the table. There is some cheese in the fridge. There is some there cheese is in the fridge. In the fridge. In the fridge. There isn't any cheese in the fridge. There is there any cheese in the fridge. Is the there... Fridge. Is there any cheese in the fridge? Is there any cheese there in the fridge? Bueno, aquí tenemos la misma eh, oración en afirmativo, en negativo y en pregunta. Y decimos there is some cuando es afirmativa, there isn't any cuando es negativa. Y para preguntar decimos is there any, ¿verdad? Entonces vean, utilizamos any for negative and for questions. And the exception is only when we use, would you like some? Can I have some? Why don't we have some? Okay, very good. Uh, let's see the other quantifier, O. Okay. When we use O, we say uh, that the structure is all the smell. All plants need water. Uh, all plants in general. When I say all plants need water, it's because I'm talking about all plants in general, which is something natural that they need water to survive. When I say all of, uh, all of plus the, uh, plus the article de plus noun, all of the plants in the garden die. We are talking about those plants in particular, the ones that I have in my garden because I didn't water them, okay? All of plus object pronoun, all of them were at the party. All in a mid position. We all went to the event. They were all happy. All plus time expression. We worked all day. Susan, Susan slept all morning. Everything, everybody, okay? In this case, we say, we, we don't say all plus the verb. We say everything or everybody. Everything is big in the US. We cannot say all is big. We say everything is big. Everybody was there. We don't say all were there. No, everybody was there. Everything was big in the US, okay? Uh, most, we use most plus noun for saying most students think university should be free. Es como la mayoría de estudiantes piensa que la universidad debería de ser libre. Most students in general. O sea, la mayoría de estudiantes, ¿verdad? hablando de un grupo en general. Most of the students in my class are French. Those students in particular. Okay? Estamos hablando de que la mayoría de estudiantes, pero de esa clase en particular. 
most of them are French. La mayoría de ellos son franceses. And this is the case when I have most of plus the object pronoun. The object pronoun in this case is them. Okay, them. Okay, let's repeat. All plants need water. <coughs> All plants need water. All, plants need water. water. All of the plants in the garden die. All of the plants in the garden die. All of them were at the party. All of all them all were at the, at the party. We all went to the event. We, we all, all went, went to the to event. The they were all happy. They, they were, were all, all, happy. Happy. all happy. We worked all day. We worked, we we worked all, day. all day. Susan slept all morning. Susan, Susan slept, slept all, all morning. morning. Everything is being big in the U.S. Everybody in the U.S. Everybody was there. Everybody was there. Okay, most students think university should be free. Most students think university should be free. Most of the students in my class are French. Most of the students in my class are French. Most of them are French. Most, Most of, of them, them are, French. are French. Very good. Here I have another chart uh, for you to see in a clearer way. Affirmative, countable, and affirmative and countable. Okay. For affirmative countable, I use a lot of books, many books, some books, few books, no books. For affirmative and countable, a lot of milk, some milk, a little milk, no milk. For negative, a lot of books, many books, any books, a lot of milk, much milk, any milk. Okay. How many books? How many books? How much milk? For interrogative or questions. Okay, now here we have some uh, examples of sentences. And we say, there are a lot of good musicians in the festival. There was little milk in the fridge. There were no dogs in the garden. There aren't many activities in the workshop. I couldn't buy much food, so little money. With so little money. Como no pude comprar mucha comida con tan poquito dinero. That's our complaining every payday. Es <laughs> nuestra queja cada día de pago. <laughs> yes. How many CDs does she have? How much music has she studied? Okay, so there you have some examples. So what I want you to do now is to think in affirmative, negative, or interrogative sentences using at least one of those, okay? Quiero que piense cada uno de ustedes en una oración afirmativa, en una negativa y en una interrogativa. Eh, siguiendo eh, el ejemplo que tenemos, ¿verdad? For example, okay. I can say, this year I eh, read a lot of books. My daughter drinks a lot of milk at night. Um, how much milk does your baby drink? Okay, that should be an example of my questions, of my sentences, two sentences and one question. So I will give you one minute to think about and that you can provide one example for each one. Okay, le voy a dar un minuto para que vean los, el modelo y para que me ayuden en elaborar una oración afirmativa, negativa e interrogativa utilizando eh, cada un, uno, ¿verdad? Una oración utilizando uno de los quantifiers. Okay, let's see, Katia has a problem connecting. When you're ready, you let me know. Cuando estén listos, me avisan, ¿verdad?
questions? <laughs> Someone ready? I'm ready, teacher. Okay, Larissa, go ahead. Tell us. Tell us your okay. sentence. Uh, affirmative. Okay. I have a lot of books in my bookcase. Okay. Negative. I haven't. Uh, well, no sé. I haven't any milk in the fridge. Yes. Um, interrogative. How many children do you have? Okay. Very good. Very good examples, Larissa. Okay. Ok, who else is ready? ¿Quién más está listo? ¿O lista? Eh, me teacher. Ok, Noé, go ahead. Eh, I, I bought mm -hmm. um, a lot of books eh, for my daughter. Ok. Um, <clears throat> um, I couldn't go because I haven't uh, much gasoline. Okay. Um, uh, um, do you have any children? Okay. Very good. Nice. Uh, let's see. Uh, yes, you can say any any children also. Okay, we can use uh, for countable questions and like here any books, any milk. Okay, very good. <coughs> okay, Noe, thank you very much. Is, okay. uh, next volunteer. Siguiente voluntario. Me teacher. Okay, Julie, go ahead. Tell us. Okay. There are some water bottles. There are some water bottles, but they are there. Okay, okay. There uh, are bo sería bottles of water. Uh, bottles of water. Yes. Okay. There aren't no one children. Uh, which one are you using? No one. And in that case could be there aren't, you, because you're talking about countable, there aren't any children. You say there aren't any children? Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. How many cats do you want here? Okay, very good. Very good, Julie, thank you. Uh, next volunteer. Hello, good evening. Hello, good evening, Guillermo. How are you today? Fine, fine, thanks. Okay. Uh, maybe I can say okay, there no are worries. many cars in my way. I know. <laughs> it's a lot of traffic everywhere. Don't worry about it. We are happy to uh, have Next. <laughs> there are pills in my way to home. <laughs> yes, I know. <laughs> okay, but it's good that you're at home um, finally and safe. <laughs> finally, I, how I can go to my house fast. <laughs> yes, no, it's impossible. It's better safe than fast and unsafe, okay? Okay. <laughs> okay, very good. Okay, um, are you ready with your examples? So, Guillermo? I, it's you, with me, plus. <laughs> yes, but, uh, oh, sorry. Uh, could you repeat them again? You okay, said, here's one. You said, I, I have, say I, I there are many cars of... in my way. Yes, very good. <laughs> okay, uh, next I say there aren't pins in my way to home. <laughs> okay. Uh, next I, I guess how I can go to my house fast. Okay, but in this case, uh, mm -hmm. since we are using how, but we are using... Um, these quantifiers, a lot, any, and, and so on. So you can say maybe, how can I go fast uh, without any cars blocking my way? Something like that. Ah, uh, okay. To use how I can go fast with, what is, how? <laughs> uh, how can how? I go fast without okay. a lot of cars 
or without any cars blocking my way. Uh, okay, okay. Okay, great. I get it. Very good. Okay, um, Isabelita, are you ready? No, I'm ready. You're not ready yet. Sorry, no. You say no, not yet. Okay, no, let's ready. see. She has a Hi, teacher. Any, Hi, any Katia. Great, you are here. We were missing you. Yes, but the connection is... I know, sometimes it's, it's good. difficult. Okay, very good. Good to have you here, Katia. I don't Thank know you. if you're ready to participate or you need extra time to see your classmates. I think. <laughs> okay, very good. Okay, uh, David? Yes. Yes, teacher. Are you ready, my dear? Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay, David, go ahead. Uh, there are a lot of books in the library. Okay. Uh, I, am, I am not many activities in the church. I don't have many activities. I, I don't have many don't activities have in my many church. Activity in, in my church. Okay, and what about the question? Uh, how much food has he ate? Okay. Uh, okay. Thank you, David. Uh, Nicholas. Are you ready, my friend? Yeah, hello. Okay, hello. Uh, the number one. Okay. There are a lot of sand on the beach. Yes. Are uh, the there are mm -hmm. negative. Sorry, teacher. <laughs> I know right negative. You sand. haven't right a negative, okay? Uh, what about the? <coughs> I try, teacher. There are, there are a lot salt on the kitchen. Okay, there, 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 there is no. There, excuse me. There is no salt at the kitchen. There is no salt. Salt at the kitchen. Salt. Yes. <coughs> salt is salt. 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 Yes. Okay. How many rain? How many rain fill to the ground? How much rain? Because remember that is an uncountable. Uh, how much? Yes. How much rain fill to the ground? Yes. Okay, <coughs> very good. Uh, okay. Maybe you, you need to drink a little bit of water. Some water. You need to drink. Okay. Uh, Let's see, uh, Isabelita was saying, she was right. I, I say two and affirmative. Yes. And negative, teacher. Okay. I try. Okay. Um, there was a little uh, meal mm -hmm. in the fridge. Okay. Um, I could, could, couldn't. I couldn't. I couldn't buy much uh, chicken fries mm -hmm. um, with so little money. With so little money. Very good. And question? No, no question, right? Mm. You may say, how much does the uh, chicken cost or something like that. But basically, you know how to use how much or how many, right? Okay. Okay. Thank you, Isabelita. Very good. So let me see, Katia. Are you ready now? Yes. Okay. Go I ahead. I think okay. my brother have a... Okay. I don't have any milk in the fridge. Okay. And how much chocolate do you eat? Okay, very good. Uh, could you repeat the first, the affirmative, because we lose you. I couldn't Brother, hear. a lot of seeds. Okay. 
Okay, great. Thank you. I think that the, that nobody is missing uh, of participation. So we are going to continue. And in here I have uh, some uh, statements or affirmative sentences, negative sentences and questions using some in this case. I have some cookies when uh, there is plural nouns. When there are uncountable noun, I can also use, I need some water because I'm talking about an affirmative sentence or an statement. Uh, when I'm talking about a negative sentence, I say, I don't have any cookies. I don't need any water. Also, I can use any for negative, no matter if they are uh, plural nouns or uncountable nouns. Uh, for questions, normally I use, do you have any cookies? Do you need water? Do you need any water? But also in the, in the previous uh, chart, we learn about the exceptions that when we, when we offer using the expression, would you like, I can say, would you like some water? Can I have some coffee, please? When I ask for something or when I suggest, why don't we have some, uh, milk to to prepare uh, a milkshake or something like that so this is an exception to the rule very good so now uh, it says uh, note one uh, with wh questions uh, with questions in which we expect the answer to be yes we can use some instead of any for example could you please give me some bananas uh, in the note number two, it says some common and countable nouns include coffee, food, help, homework, information, milk, money, paper, rice, salt, soup, sugar, tea, time, and water. Those are all uncountable nouns. Okay, so what we are going to do now is to fill in the blanks below to complete the sentence using, using some or any that are other quantifiers. Uh, in the example number one, it says, I don't need any money because I'm going to bring my lunch to school. Okay? No voy a necesitar nada de dinero porque voy a llevar mi refrigerio o mi almuerzo en este caso, ¿verdad? A la escuela. Number two, he doesn't have any. Any. Okay, any pens. Let's see here. He doesn't have any pens, but I have some, some pens. Some pens. Okay, very good. <coughs> what about number three? Our teacher didn't give us any, any or some. Okay. Some very good. homework. Any homework? Home. Oh, any. Uh. Yesterday. I'm tired. Do we have space time to take a nap? Any or some? Any. Okay, remember that for questions we can use any. Some casi solo lo utilizamos para oraciones afirmativas, ¿verdad? No importa si es con uncountable or, count or countable nouns. But for negative and questions, we use any. Okay, number five. Do they have? Any. 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 Okay, very good. Do we have any library cards? No, they don't have? Any. Any. Okay, very good. Paul wants to buy new shoes. Some. Okay, very good. What about, um, excuse me, I need space Some. information. Some. Okay. I don't have space paper, but Mary has. So, which I is the I don't person? have any. Any paper. Okay, any. Let's see here. Oops. But Mary has some. 
Okay, very good. And the last one, Mr. Smith has Some. questions that he wants to ask you. Some. Okay, very good. So now let's repeat, let's repeat together. I don't need any money because I'm going to bring my lunch to school. I don't need any money because I'm going to bring my lunch to school. Okay, very good. He doesn't have any pens, but I have some pens. He doesn't have any pens, but I have some pens. Our teacher didn't give us any homework yesterday. Or Our teacher, teacher didn't give us, us any homework yesterday. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm tired. Do we tired. have any time to take a nap? Do we, Do we have, have any time, any time, to, time to, take to take a nap? Do they have any library cards? Do they, they have, have any, any library, library, cards? Any library no, cards? No, they don't have any. No, no. They, don't they, have don't they don't have, have any. any. Who wants to buy some new shoes? Oh, All wants, wants to, to buy, buy some new shoes. Very good. I don't have any paper, but Mary has some. I don't, I don't have, have any paper, paper, but Mary has, has some. Some. Uh, some. Mr. Smith has some questions that we that he wants to ask you. Mr. Mr. Smith has, has some, some questions, questions that he wants to ask you. ask you. Okay, very good. So now you know how to use some and any. Remember that some is for affirmative statements, any is for negative statements, and for questions. Okay? So let's see to the other slide because we have two more. Okay, here I have a conversation between Lucy and Alan. And Lucy is asking uh, how, how uh, to, let's see. Yes, they are talking about how to elaborate a, an apple pie. And Lucy says, how about making, and what is the right, a or an? An. An, an apple pie, very good, because apple starts with a vowel. Great idea, do we have some or any apples? Any apples. Yes, any because apples. it's a question. Do we have any apples? Yes, there are a few or a little. A few. A few. A few in the kitchen because remember that this is a countable noun. I can count, count the apples. One, two, three, four, five apples. How much or how many do we need? How many? How many, how many, how many do we need? Many. Okay. And Alan says, a lot or a little? About a kilo. A kilo. A lot. A lot. About a kilo. Very good. There aren't many or much. There aren't many. Many. We can buy some or any. Some. Some. Okay. Very good. Uh, now we have the second conversation between Alan and Lucy, the second part. Let's see, okay, very good. And it says, and we need a little or a few sugar too. A little. A little. Okay, very good, uncountable. How many or how much do we need? How much? How much, yes. How much? Half a kilo, says Alan, half kilo. Oh no, there isn't some or any. Any, any. very good. Any. Okay, write it, write it on the list. We also need some or any eggs. Uh, some. some. Some eggs. Some eggs. Very good. How much or how many are there in the fridge? How many? How many? Yes, because we can count the eggs. And Lucy yes. says a little or a few. A few. A few. A few, a few. Yes. Ooh, there are four. There are four, okay. And Alan says, okay, let's go to the supermarket to buy all the ingredients. Okay, I hope you haven't forgotten the right answers <laughs> because I need two volunteers. I need uh, that you form pairs and that one of you plays the role of Lucy and one of you plays the role <laughs> of Alan. And we are going to perform the conversation using the right answer. Okay, necesito que busquen a una pareja 
y van a hacer la conversación. Uno va a ser Alan, el otro va a ser Lucy. Y la idea es que lo hagan con las respuestas correctas que me acaban de decir, ¿verdad? Ok. Ok. You start looking. Ok. You decide. Ok. Mi teacher. Ok, Katia, who will be your partner? Uh, Julie. Ok, Julie. Katia is asking okay. for you to cooperate and, do, and perform the conversation. Ok. Ok, Matías, go ahead. I am Lucy. Ok. How about making an apple pie? Great idea. Do we have any apple? Okay. Yes, there are a few in the kitchen. How many we, do we need? Mm, a lot, a lot, a, a kilo. There aren't many. We can buy some in the store. And we need a, a little sugar too. Sugar. Sugar. Yes. How much do we need? Half kilo. Oh no, there isn't any. Okay, right on the list. We also need uh, some eggs. How many are there in the fridge? A few. There are four. Okay, let's go to the supermarket to buy all the ingredients. To buy, to buy all buy. the ingredients. To buy all the ingredients. Okay, very good. Thank you, Julie and Katia, for being the first uh, partners to participate. I need two more volunteers now. Uh, me, teacher. Okay, Noé, who are you going to work with? Um, and let me, Isabel. Isabelita, are you there? Yes. Okay, you decide. I'm Lucy. Okay, <laughs> very good. Okay. How about making an apple pie? Great idea. <clears throat> Do we have any apple? Yes, there are a uh, few in the kitchen. How um, many do you need? Um, a lot, about a kilo. There aren't um, much. Many. We can buy. Uh, there aren't many we can buy. Um, some in the store. And we need um, a few sugar too. A little. A little. Uh, yes, because it's uncountable. Okay, and we need a little sugar too. How many do you do we need? Um, half kilo. Oh no, there is, isn't any. Okay, write it on the list. We also need some eggs. How, how many are there in the fridge? Um, few, there are four. Okay, let's go to the supermarket to buy all the ingredients. Okay, very good. Thank you, Noen. Thank you, Isabel. I need another two volunteers. Two volunteers más? Me, teacher. Okay. Uh, David? Sorry, yes. 
Okay, David, and who are you going to work with? We have Nicolas, we have... Uh, Nicolas. Guillermo, okay, very good. Nicholas. Okay, Nicolas. Hi, Nicolas. Hello, hello. Sorry, sorry. Hello, Nicolas. Okay. Would you like to start? <clears throat> Um, Nicolas. Yes, yes. Repeat, please. Okay. okay, Nicolas, would you like to start the conversation? And uh, David is going to continue, or, or you would like that David starts and you continue? Who would you like to be, Lucy or Alan? Uh, no problem. I am Lucy. Okay, you start. Please. Okay. Okay. How about making an apple pie? Great. Yeah. Do we have any apples? Yes. There are a few in the kitchen. How, ma uh, how how many do we need? Mm -hmm. A lot, about a kilo. There aren't, there aren't uh, many. Can <laughs> I, uh, <clears throat> some in the store? Mm -hmm. Um, we need a little sugar too. Um, mm? How many do we need? How much? Because we are talking how much? about sugar. It's an uncountable. Okay. How much do we need? Half kilo. Oh no. There isn't. There isn't some. There isn't any. There a, isn't any. Yes, it's a negative sentence. Okay. Uh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Write it on the list. We also need some egg. How many are there in the fridge? Uh, um, there are four, I, what? A, a few, right? A, a few, there are four. Okay. Okay, let's go to, a, to the supermarket to buy all the ingredients. 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 Yes, very okay. good. Okay, okay, thank you, David, thank and you. thank you, Nicolas. David, okay. I would like to ask you to please start the conversation and participate with Guillermo. Okay. Okay, Guillermo, are you ready? Okay. Okay. Uh, ah, sorry. <laughs> Isabelita, o quién? No, Larisa. 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 So, sorry, sorry. Thank you, uh, David. So, Larisa and Guillermo, you okay. decided Thank who you. start. <laughs> sorry, Larisa, I forgot. <laughs> no problem. Okay, Guillermo. I am okay. Lucy. Okay. Okay, I am Alan. Okay. How about making an, ap an apple pie? Great idea. Great idea. 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 Do we have some apples? Any apples. Any apples. Do you have any apples? Yes. Yes. There are a few in the kitchen. How many do, you, do we need? A lot. Uh, about, about a kilo. There aren't many. There aren't many. We can buy uh, some in the store. Uh, we need uh, a few or a little? A little. It's a little. A little. Yes, a because little. we are talking about sugar. Yes, okay. we need a little sugar too. How much do you need? Do we need? How many? I'm oh, sorry, yes, how much? Sorry, mm. how much? How much? Um, what 
do you say medio kilo? <laughs> half, half kilo. Half kilo. Mm -hmm. Meaning oh. half kilo. Oh no, there isn't any. ¿Qué significa eso, mami? <laughs> Cute baby. Oh no, no hay ni nada. ¿Qué significa eso? Oh no, no hay nada. Okay, <laughs> write it on. Write it on in the lights, list. On, on the list. We, on the list. We also need um, <clears throat> some X. Some X. How many are there in the fridge? Fridge. A few. A few. There are four. Okay, let's go to the supermarket to buy all of the ingredients. 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 Okay, yes, very good. Congratulations, Larissa and Guillermo. All of you did a great job. So now, um, just to continue the practice, and before we finish, I would like to do at least the first part. I can have, uh, sorry, can I have lemonade, please? So which could you use? Any. Yes, but remember Any. this. ¿Se recuerdan de la excepción? Ah, yes. Sí. Can I have Can some lemonade, I please? Have... Esa es la excepción, ¿verdad? Cuando yo pregunto si puedo obtener algo o cuando me ofrecen, ¿sí? Entonces, en ese caso es some. Very good. Some. And sí. what about, uh, let's see. I'm sorry, but there isn't any. any. Ay, sí, any, ¿verdad? Porque ya no hay. Lo siento, pero ya no hay. Ok, would you like... Some. Some. Very good. Se recuerda, some. es la excepción. La excepción consiste en que utilizamos some para yeah. preguntas solamente cuando yo pido algo, can I have, or, o cuando me ofrecen mm -hmm. algo, would you like, ok? Would you like some orange juice? Okay. Yes, please. Uh, what are you eating for lunch? Ajá. Uh -huh. Y dice space tuna sandwich and apple. ¿Cuál de atún, a tuna sandwich. A tuna sandwich. And an apple. Okay. A tuna sandwich and an apple. An apple. Very good. An apple because the next word starts with a vowel, so we use a consonant. Are you going to buy lemons for the salad? Um, uh, any. 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 This case is any, any right? It's a question. Ajá, es una pregunta. <laughs> sí, y no lleva ni quién, ni lleva would you like, ¿verdad? Yes. Are you going to buy any lemons for the salad? No, there aren't. Perdón, no, no. There are some in the fridge. Mm. Entonces, después del fridge, es una oración afirmativa, ¿verdad? There are some in the fridge. But there aren't any tomatoes. Any tomatoes. Ok, tomatoes. very good. Just a few. Mm. What about, uh, oh, there is some bread left. Some bread. Oh. Some bread left. Yes. And what about the other one? Uh, let's buy a loaf and then, then and some, some, and bananas. some bananas. bananas. Very good. Nice. Okay. Let's see the last part. How many face peppers do we have? How many. Many. Okay. Very good. <clears throat> What about the other? Very few. Get some more. Is there milk on the fridge? Uh, much. Any. Any, right? Any, any because any. It's, a, uh, it's a question. It's a question, actually. Is there any milk in the fridge? No. <laughs> no. Not. Not. Any. Not any, right? Any. We need to buy a bottle. The soup needs... 
So. Yes, very good. Some more salt. Some more salt. Yes. Uh, what about the other one? Really? It tastes fine to me. Okay, that's that's it. And nine. There are there cookies left? Any. Any. Okay, very Any. good. Mm. Uh, I'm afraid not. How? How much or many. how many? How many? Okay. How many orange? Yes, because you can, you can count them. I have any orange. I have any or apple. some. Some. Yes, some. I oh. have some mm. oranges. Ah, perdón, tiene razón, Katia. I have any. Any, any orange, yes, any only apples. Orange only. Lo que nos cambia todo es ese only. ¿Verdad? No tengo ninguna naranja. Solamente Solo manzanas. Manzanas. Very good. Ok, congratulations. You did a great job. Ok. <laughs> so we were able to complete this part. Uh, by uh, tomorrow we are going to continue practicing because we couldn't finish uh, today. But I would like to ask you to please go to the platform and advance as much as you can. Please go and answer the exercise that is about um, this lecture <coughs> that is in 3.9, the knowledge check, okay? Uh, in the knowledge check, you will find there is and there are exercises. So please go and complete. I hope to see you tomorrow. I would like that you can um, rest and have a, a good day tomorrow. And see you tomorrow then, okay? Thank you, teacher. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. Good night. Good night. Bye.